Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I'll be doing a review on the Olens Chandelier Collection. So it comes out with two different colors and it was inspired by the glitter of chandelier. So yeah, so they come out with the color gray and the color brown. But first let's talk about the packaging. So the packaging just looks like this, which is actually very simple yet very luxurious looking. The reason why it is in a box like this, not like your typical Orleans box, is because this particular collection, it lasts per pair of lens actually lasts for three months. So obviously it's a little bit more pricey, but if you think about it, you're paying I think 34 USD dollars for actually three months rather than one month. I know in the previous video you guys have said that I think it was the old lens purse per was pretty pricey but you have to take in consideration that it does last for three months not one month so if you're a regular user three months would definitely be very affordable and great but if you're not a regular user like me it will be pretty tricky to actually think about the cost and then thinking about the design so yeah, i hope that makes sense anyway back to the packaging it looks like this and then when you actually open up to secure the contact lens, it actually comes in this um, plastic packaging, which is great. And then when you open, so when you open this up, it comes out with two of this little jar thing. So when it comes in a jar like this, straight away, I'm pretty sure you guys know it's, I guess it's sort of like circle lenses, which is also like enlarging contact lens, which is exactly what it is. The diameter for this is actually 14.3, but apparently the graphic diameter is like 13.7. But again, I'm wearing it right now, so you can see it is an enlarging effect contact lens. The bottle itself this time round, I actually find it a bit tricky to actually open it up. So just really be careful when you actually open it up. Follow the arrow, pull the lid slowly, not too quickly because when you pull it quickly, it really step off really quick and then the metal part just stays on there. And so I had to use a scissor to actually um, cut off the rest, but definitely be careful when you do open stuff like this. And then usually what I do is I just pour it into one of my contact lens um, container before I put it on my ass. So let's talk about the color chandelier brown first. So again, it has, I'm looking down at the contact lens. So it has like three tone, but almost like two and a half um, tone of brown color. So first you have that dark brown rim, which I like because I don't like something that is black because you don't want to make it look so obvious that you're wearing such a massive contact lens so I like that it's dark brown and then as you go in you have like this floral petal outline around the rim as well to go into your pupil and then around your pupil area it has like that brown stripey thing that goes around it somehow so I like that it has like all this different design but once you actually put it on your eye it actually look pretty nice so I guess having all those designs does make sense to make the eye contact lens looks nice on your eyes for me compared to the model for me the brown is much more darker than the model if it looks like the model itself i think i would like it more i mean it's a nice brown but it's not as nice compared to this particular gray with this gray color i just fell in love with it like straight away i wore this i was like oh my goodness this just make my eyes look so dolly I just love it so much. I just can't help staring at my eyes non-stop with this particular eyelashes as well. It just looks so beautiful guys. So first you have that brown rim again which is what I like, dark brown rim. And as you go in, you actually have like two different colors to it as well. And it's not like two different same shade. It's like, so first you go in, you have that grey. And then as you go in towards more of your pupa, you have that hazel green color as well. And then in between as well, you have that brown stripey. So I guess if you think about it, this contact lens actually have three different colors, which I don't know, what do you guys think? I really, really like this gray one, definitely way more than the brown. So my recommendation, if you were to get a contact lens um, from this collection, definitely get this gray and I feel like if you have like a lighter eye color I feel like the gray would just be lighter and I guess it will really complement your eyes as well like for me myself already I have dark eyes this gray just sparks out like it's just poof. it's just so pretty guys like this gray I love it so much even though it is it does have that enlarging effect I feel like it is not that large 
for me like because I'm used to circle lenses but I feel like this particular color is just gonna be like my top favorite now but yeah definitely really like this gray so yeah um comfort wise it is actually very comforting but again because of the enlarging effect I did put a little bit of eye drop in the beginning so I don't get any redness or dryness but again I've worn the brown one before and the gray one and it lasts for a pretty long time like without it being really dry but yeah, definitely recommend to put eye drop if you do have dry eyes just because of the contact lens diameter. One more thing I want to mention before I end this video is that when you actually tip the contact lenses out into the container, the contact lenses actually turn inside out. So be mindful of that it's very easy to identify which way it's the right way. So obviously the darker side is actually where you have it on the outer part of your eyes and then the lighter part goes inwards I hope that makes sense but you can tell that it is inside out so just be mindful of that so I hope you guys enjoy this chandelier collection review I do have another one which is I think the honey collection which has like three colors as well so yeah any more suggestions or any more questions in regards of this collection definitely put it down in the comment box below but yeah I'll see you guys on my next video bye